What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, FB Math, back with another video. FB Math. why I feel like I say that, like it's like a tongue twister almost. Somebody say it, FB Math. It's not Facebook Aftermath, because a lot of people be saying Facebook Aftermath. But anyways, today's video, it's not a workout video. There's a workout included in it, but we got a full day of eating. In the simplest way, not the simplest simplest, but it's an easy day of eating. Now, before I do all my eating, I like to get my workout done fasted. I don't like to eat before my workouts. That's just how I prefer it. But we started out with five sets of eight for pull-ups. Been loving pull-ups, continually doing them. I just feel like everybody should be doing pull-ups regardless, because it's kind of embarrassing to not be able to do pull-ups as a, you know, as a fitness athlete but we move on to the outside area. We're heading on to the bench press. I don't wanna to waste too much energy, so I have to get my biggest lift basically out the way first. Now we work up to a top set. Um, we work up to 500, which you'll see in a little bit, but the sets before that are about like 15 reps, 10 reps, eight, um, and then five. Once I hit 405, um, that you'll see in a little bit, I think I only went for like five, and then ones after that to my top set. Days like this, where I'm not fully feeling it. I just kind of play with the waters and, and see what each weight after 405 feels like. So you'll see 475 right now, which I mean, it felt good. It moved good for me. Um, 475 is something I can hit any day, but for those who know, I was at 545. I believe until I had the shoulder impingement. And once again, I'm a wrestler, so it's it was bound to happen. Um, right now I'm taking my lights from Rule Ones, Electrolytes. So if you want some supplements, some great supplements, 10% off, man. Use code Aftermath, the link will be in the description. Definitely support your boy. Now we're getting ready for our 500, you know, a weight that I usually hit every week. You see me? I'm trying to like, there's like this weird movement in my shoulder that I can't get it to properly be in the right position. Um, so I'm working on getting that better. Uh, I did take a break from doing my proper bench warm ups for my shoulder. See, I couldn't even hit it because like that middle range, I lose power. There's something in my shoulder like in that middle range where I don't even feel it anymore. So I said F that moved on to decline and we just focused on muscle growth um decline and the seal press so we went back and forth about eight to twelve reps for both well actually eight to twelve for bench press and for the seal rows we worked around five to eight um so a little bit less reps but working on the seal row with 225 and plus it, it's pretty difficult you know sometimes i worked at 315 but that's only for like maybe two to three reps so we just worked on a little bit more volume with the seal rows and uh, hopefully this will help realign where my shoulders should be and strengthen my shoulders and my rear delts and things but moving on simple three sets of 20 of the incline flies and then three sets of 15 to 20 for the tricep push downs just nice little volume stuff Next, we're moving on to abs. Well, the last thing we're moving on to abs and everything you see right now will be two sets of 20. Um, so I think I did about three exercises. Um, so I did the knee ups and then I did the cables and went to some lateral stuff. But I mean, it's a simple workout, you know, full body, full upper body, my bad, full upper body without shoulders i guess but i guess with the seal rows there would be some shoulders i'm just talking but anyways the lateral movement that i was talking about for the abs and hitting the obliques hitting those um those love handle areas just to protect the spine more especially with wrestling so that's it what you doing lazy girl all right it's late in the day, man. I, I woke up hella late. I mean, I went to bed hella late last night. I woke up at three, and now I'm about to eat at three. It's 2.59, uh, well, later than three, because I gotta cook. So now we have breakfast. It's gonna be a late night kind of food day. Um, and then after breakfast, I got some work to do, and then we're gonna go get a little bit, a few more groceries. Babe already got some groceries, but we're gonna get a few more groceries. Um, um, Cause, yo, my meal, my meal shit's super simple, yo. But let's go ahead and make breakfast. Getting abs. 
Or you get them cuts in the middle. You get that middle? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta let him know. Gotta let him know. Got ten more pounds to like be like, okay, I'm good. And then I want another like six on top of it. Actually, I have to take twenty from where I'm at right now. I'm going to be finished with you in a moment. <laughs> God dang. <laughs> You're just going to be a photo camera. All right, so as you can see, we have five pieces of bacon, three eggs, two waffles. We're sitting at around 40 grams of protein right here. And then we're going to add another 25 with protein from rule one. So our pure vanilla, naturally flavored, banned substance testers. Don't be like Ryan Garcia and take regular supplements, but they're not tested properly. And he ended up having some shit in them. And they confirmed that there was shit in their factory. So, first meal, total of around 60 grams of protein. water today for the for this meal if I have a protein shake by itself later I'll have it with uh, milk almond milk but yeah with this on the real I'll take the protein shake first get full off of that because I might not even eat all of my carbs with this meal so Calorie hack, drink your protein shake first. You're smiling that girl, I'll pop me in your jaw. Baby crying. Fuck that baby crying. <laughs> Fuck that baby. RP string prove scientific study that your protein synthesis is higher when you consume more calories with your protein. So more calories with protein, more protein synthesis, which means more usable protein that the body's going to digest, build the muscles, you feel me? 
So I'm about to go eat breakfast. I don't know what you're going to be doing. I guess you're going to continue to watch this video because I ain't about to keep it rolling. Oh, you crazy. Uh, this little boy trying to rip his damn face off. Oh, the Mexican, the little Mexican dude? Yeah, yeah the baby? Oh, and, and he's baby. like, bro, chill. Go, go back up. Oh. I thought he was Hispanic for some reason, but yeah, that's the video. It's so funny, I have a perfectly fine 70 inch TV in there, and here I am watching TV on a 27 inch monitor. I'm finishing up Helsing. This shit's been crazy, bro. I still got, what, one more episode left? But yeah. Hey, I already pulled most of it out. Got some organic raisin bran cluster cereal. Jasmine rice, six, two packs of six. Easy snack meal, and chicken soup dumplings. And chicken cilantro, mini wontons. Arugula with the beef bulgogi that I've been tearing up for a week and I'm about to continue, continue tearing up for another week. About 70 of these, all the turnout. This is simple eating, ladies and gentlemen. Simple eating. You feel me? So, next up, we have two of these. That is going to be 26 grams of protein plus another protein shake. What do you know? You can almost eat anything you want with a scoop of protein. Sorry, I might look crazy right now. Let me look, let me go in the other mirror. I got patches. I got patches and shit on my face. I got dark spot up here. I got dark spot over here. I got a pimple right here. I look a mess. Pimple right here. Like I just got bumps everywhere right now. I don't know what the hell is going on, man. I stopped using that. That La Poche Cose. Let's dry my skin out. Dry skin is not good. I, I noticed that over time. I always use products that dry my skin the fuck out. Moisturize, baby, ain't that right? Moisture. Moisture will give you the oyster. You feel me? All right, so let's go ahead and, and once again, simple eating. Like, this is this, any, Besides breakfast, everything is basic as fuck. If you if you don't feel like cooking really, short on time, your busy schedule, whatever it is, it's quick. Besides breakfast, even though breakfast was still fast, you know, get cook breakfast in 10, 15 minutes. You know what I'm saying? So, with that being said, I would now like to introduce chicken dumpling. And the little package like this. And these are 250 calories each. So all together this is 500 calories plus the 180 um, from the protein shake. Throw them in the microwave. Bow, bow, bow. Now you know. Cause it's mine, Super Show Show. As for the bulgogi and the rice. And I'll throw these in the refrigerator. And the wontons. Put up a wonton. Go hit me up. Take go hit me up. What the fuck this is? Alright, let's put things in their perspective. So breakfast was 
980 calories. Probably about, well, let's put it at 1,020. 1,050. Let's put it at 1,050. For breakfast. Big breakfast. 1,050. Now with these, I just threw them away. We got... Fifteen fifty plus one eighty seventeen thirty. So now with this meal we'll be at seventeen thirty for the day. And then the last meal we will have. We'll get to that when we get to the last meal. I don't want to spoil it. These out. Nice and steaming. Now we had the vanilla flavor, natural flavor earlier. Now I'm gonna to move to my favorite flavor. I have the, the one I least like flavor wise at first and the one I like more later. Fruity cereal. This even tastes great with water. Be one with water. From rule one. You guys I know these are my sponsors. So use code aftermath for 10% off of this great brand. Now fruity cereal really is like it slaps. I'm not even gonna bullshit y'all. It slaps. I ordered some other flavors from them, like a strawberries and cream, something like that. Um, because I feel like that would taste good too. If this one tastes good, I feel like something like that would taste good too. And then the salted caramel as well um, that I have. And I'll have that later because it actually goes well with the bulgogi. Actually, no, I'm not gonna have it with the goalie. I just spoiled something. I'm gonna edit that out. <laughs> but I'm not gonna edit that out. I'm just gonna, whatever. Once again, I drink the shake before each meal, before the meal. And that will last me until my last meal, you know? <laughs> you know how I be doing the animes? <laughs> that little smoke cloud. Just imagine that happen. This is what it looks like right there. Nice little stain thing. These things good as hell too, man. Oh, I ain't caught up with one piece. Shit. That's what I missed. Zoro outfit in this shit go hard. That shit go hard, boy. All right, ladies and gentlemen, the finale. Don't call me Sally. All start a rally. Beef go. Now, one pack is three servings. I eat an entire pack alone. Hello. Hello. No? You don't remember that? You don't know where that's from at all. Come on, man. Those are the future SpongeBob. When Squidward was going in different dimensions. She ain't hip. She don't like me right now for some reason. I didn't do nothing. I'm just reading my book. Sound like flock of ad bow, 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 Now I got that song stuck in her head. She can't read 
Alright, anyway. Can't tune me out. I'm untunable. I'm in fact tuna fish. Gotta clean this up from the bacon. Got me my steak in. All right, so here is how simple it is. Turn this on, boom. Open this up right here. Peel it off. Oh, I forgot to put a little avocado oil in it. Mmm, smells so good when it's opened up. You just lay that meat in there, however you want to. You just lay it in there. The second easiest part, the rice. That's what you do with the rice. Undress it. And throw it in the microwave for three minutes. I like to go ahead and start it because I like it to cool down. Yeah, I'll give it a little bit more time. I'm going to start sizzling actually. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so we got our bulgogi. Like I said, this is three servings. There's 21 grams, a serving. So we have 40, what, three, I mean, 63. What, wait, 40? Yeah, 63 grams of protein right here, along from the bulgogi. We have our rice. And then softened up, because th this is a very, uh, how do I say this? Flavor-wise, it's strong, you know what I'm saying? It tastes good by itself, but the avocado definitely simmers it down it's a nice little soft taste to it you feel me i feel you baby so let's go to the room and i'll calculate all right so with everything this puts me at around 3,000 calories right now and then i'll have my protein shake which will put me over just a bit under 3,500 calories for the day now this is my maintenance uh, meal basically um, you know this is just kind of my everyday fuel not necessarily a cut this is uh, my maintenance is pretty much a body recomp um, so between like that three to thirty five hundred um, is my safe spot uh, especially with my training and stuff so this is how I eat for the day you know it's not bad simple day had a good breakfast, had a decent, you know, middle meal, uh, protein shakes, you know, with that, and have a wonderful, easy dinner. So, uh, I've been eating this actually consistently for the past, what, a few weeks now? And I'm the type of person that can eat the same shit all the time. Babe can't, but I'm simple, yo. Back when I used to compete, I was eating tilapia and rice, and then beef and rice, and then chicken and rice every single day, you know, back to back. But now... I mean, I mean, I enjoyed that, you know, I, I like this, you know, tilapia back then, um, how I cooked that black ended, but I, I enjoy all my meals, you know, it's not hard for me. Um, this is high calorie. Now, if, you know, if I was to cut it lower, I would cut out, if I want to be under 3000, basically I would cut out half the rice, uh, cause I have two servings of rice right here. So I'll cut out half the rice. I probably, I can cut out the avocado or I can, yeah, can kind of keep the avocado, um, Take out the waffles earlier and then simmer down a bit of the syrup earlier as well. And then uh, that's yeah, that's about it.
you know, just take out those. Just kind of like cut the carbs in half, and I'll be just at like three thousand. Um, and I could probably get away with cutting at that, to be honest. So, once again, simple day, simple, simple day. A uh, good amount of protein. I think I'll be ending the full day with around 200, 20, 30 grams of protein for the day. I don't really care about the numbers or anything else because uh, my calories are still in order. They're not like, you know, far over, um, even though I had a, a good amount of carbs today. Um, so, yeah, that is it. I'm not play, I've been playing Call of Duty. I just played Call of Duty. I haven't played Call of Duty in months. I just played Call of Duty. I'm getting my ass cracked bro like well like my weapons the weapons that i used to have my m4 everything's like my f tech everything is trash like nothing is good and i feel like everybody's one-shotting me and i don't i don't get it so yeah i'm about to finish watching some anime finish my last meal hope you guys enjoyed this video hit that like button subscribe to the channel if you want to see more i can definitely make more days um different foods you know for you guys um for the day in the life, uh, what I eat in a day type of videos. So, I like I said, I, I don't like to do too much. You feel me? Because I just don't. And with the meal prepping and stuff, like, I don't like my food more than two days old. <laughs> so, so, after I cook it. So, um, yeah. That being said, I hope you enjoyed. Peace out. This meal is so good.